Hello, welcome to Daily News from Ajaya TV. Commemoration of Tasua Day in the House of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in the Holy City of Qom. On the occasion of the Day of Tasua in the year 1446 Hijri, the House of His Eminence Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in the Holy City of Qom hosted various groups of Husseini mourners, scholars, teachers, seminary students, and believers from various Islamic countries. During these ceremonies held in the presence of the Grand Ayatollah Shirazi, the attendees listened to religious speeches focusing on the uprising of Imam Hussein and the sacred Husseini rituals, followed by elegies and mourning. It is noteworthy that the viewers of Marjaya TV can watch these ceremonies live on this global TV network, other Shia satellite networks, and on the Al Shirazi application and associated TV boxes. Continuation of activities by Sayyid Ahmad Shirazi in Muharram 1446 in Kuwait. Sayyid Ahmad Shirazi, son of the Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi, continues his activity during the first 10 days of Muharram 1446 in Kuwait. He participated in morning ceremonies at the Husseiniyas of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, Imam Hassan Mushtaba, peace be upon him, Imam Hassan Askari, peace be upon him, and Hazrat Muslim Ibn Aqil, peace be upon him, as well as at the home of Haji Hamza Anki. He also visited several religious groups and met with their members. Morning ceremonies for the first 10 days of Muharram 1446 at Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's office in Karbala. During the first 10 days of Muharram 1446, the office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussein Shirazi in Karbala held morning ceremonies for Imam Hussein. These ceremonies saw the participation of dozens of mourners and followers of the Ahlul Bayt, including religious, cultural and social figures and representatives of various religious authorities. Commemoration of Imam Hussein in Lebanon with a speech by a representative of the religious authority. At the invitation of the Husseiniyah, Imam Hussein ibn Ali in Beirut, Lebanon, Sheikh Jalal Ma'ash, a representative of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi, delivered a speech to the mourners. The ceremony held on the third night of Muharram 1446 honored the martyrdom of Imam Hussein. Sheikh Ma'ash discussed the ethical position of Imam Hussein, the responsibility of believers to revive his traditions, and the ethical behavior of Imam Hussein with Hor and his army. Activities of the Global Assembly of Husseini Associations and Processions in Baghdad and Kadamiya, Iraq. The Global Assembly of the Husseini Associations affiliated with the International Institute of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in Kabbalah carried out activities on the fourth day of Muharram 1446 in Baghdad and the Holy City of Kadamiya in Iraq. They participated in morning ceremonies at the Husseini Aghasro Zahra, met with Sheikh Ali Samawi, a Husseini preacher, Nasir Shamani, the director of the Husseiniyah, and several poets and eulogists. They also attended ceremonies of the Baghdad Residence Morning Group, linked to the al sadiqa Fatima Center, and visited the procession of Rasul Adam Institute and the Husseini Al-Jawadain. Commemoration of the first 10 days of Muharram 1446 at Husseini Aghasro Zahra in Kadamiya. Husseini Aghasro Dahra in the Holy City of Kadamiya is honoring the first 10 days of Muharram 1446 with morning ceremonies. Sheikh Ali al Samami and several poets and eulogists are delivering speeches and leading these ceremonies. Hundreds of mourners participate in these events, commemorating Imam Hussein and his companions. Continuation of morning ceremonies at the PR office of the Religious Authority in Karbala. Morning ceremonies for the first 10 days of Muharram 1446 continue at the PR office of the Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussein Shirazi in Karbala. These ceremonies are attended by dozens of followers of the Ahlul Bayt and religious and academic figures who benefited from the speeches of Sheikh Rasul Allami. Continuation of morning ceremonies at religious centers in Afghanistan. With the arrival of Muharram 1446, morning ceremonies are being held in these centers, affiliated with the religious authority in Kabul, Afghanistan, to commemorate Imam Hussein. The Fatima Zahra complex and the Khadija Seminary and Quran Center are among these centers holding these ceremonies. Dozens of female students and other scholars participate in these events. Shia participation in morning ceremonies at Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's office in Kabul. As Muharram begins, the office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussein Shirazi in Kabul hosts Shia followers and devotees of Imam Hussein for the first 10 days of this month. These ceremonies, which started with the beginning of Muharram 1446, see the presence of students, teachers from Islamic seminaries, preachers, and the general public. Morning ceremonies at the Ahlul Bayt Islamic Thought Center in Baghdad. The Ahlul Bayt Islamic Thought Center in Baghdad, affiliated with the religious authority, is holding morning ceremonies for Muharram 1446. These ceremonies, which started at the beginning of this month, attract numerous Shia followers, including dozens of young people from Baghdad, and will continue for 10 days. 
She had participation in morning ceremonies at Grand Ayatollah Shirazi Center in Canada. The center of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in Montreal, Canada, hosts mourners for Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, during the first 10 days of Muharram 1446. These nightly ceremonies, which included speakers by Sheikh Saleh Sibay and Sayyid Musa Fali, also feature congregational prayers, Quran recitations, the recitation of Zirat Ashura, and morning rituals. Morning ceremonies by the Umar Bihai Institute in Kabbalah. The Umar Bihai Institute in Kabbalah, affiliated with the religious authority, held morning ceremonies on the first day of Muharram 1446. This event included a speech by Sheikh Wael al Budairi. Activities of Rasul Adam Institute's procession in Kadamiya for Muharram 1446. The Rasul Adam Institute in Kadamiya is hosting a procession for the first 10 days of Muharram 1446. The institute serves hundreds of mourners daily, providing meals, holding congregational prayers, conducting morning ceremonies, organizing chain link processions, and offering resting places for visitors. Support from the Kabbalah Charity Institute for Husseini processions in Kabbalah during Muharram 1446. The Kabbalah Charity Institute Omol Benin Guest House supports Husseini processions in Kabbalah during the first 10 days of Muharram 1446. The institute supplies these processions with various food items for free. Since its establishment in 2003, this institute has distributed food among the processions and annually supports them during this morning period.